Happy Friday. Phil Lindemann with your Crystal 93 News at Noon. First Chair Friday was Ski and Huff our Thanksgiving calories today at Breckenridge, where folks from all over were playing a round of Love It or Leave It, Turkey Day edition. So, turkey, love it or leave it. Yeah. Picking it up. Oh, yeah. Love it. Love it. Love it. Go, 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 go. Mashed potatoes, love them or leave them. Picking it up. Taking it. Leaving it. Leafing the mashed potatoes. I would rather have wow. stuffing. How about cranberry sauce? Leave it. <laughs> love it. Leave it. Love it. Leave it. Love it. Love it. Sweet potatoes? Love it. Love it. Love it. Marshmallows on your sweet potatoes? Love it. Love it. Uh, not really. Leave it. <laughs> Maybe gravy with giblets. I have no idea what that is, so leave it. <laughs> leave it. <laughs> no way, leave it. Nah, not for me, dog. No, no, no. Everyone loves Thanksgiving leftovers. But Grandma Jeannie takes it to another level. Casserole, stuffing, turkey, cheese, and gravy on top. The holidays aren't going anywhere. Starting today in Keystone for the Keystone Winter Carnival and Lighting of River Run. Santa Claus visits at 3 o'clock. Frisco Funk Collective plays Warren Station from 3 to 6. The tree lights up at 515. Over at Copper tonight, they've got a snowcat parade and fireworks at 6. More fireworks are coming to Frisco tomorrow for the Frisco tree lighting. It starts at Frisco Historic Park on Main Street at 6 p.m. And then stick around town for Wassel Days with free samples of hot spiced cider at local businesses. The manufacturer of one-wheel electric skateboards is refusing to comply with a federal recall. Four people have died and multiple people have been seriously injured or paralyzed when one-wheel engines unexpectedly cut power. One death happened in gypsum. The feds tell owners to stop using their one wheels immediately. The company, based in California, writes, We strongly disagree with unjustified and alarmist claims. Local avalanche danger is moderate again today above treeline in Summit County and the Vale area. In sports, taking the pitch right now in Qatar is the U.S. men's national team. They face England for round two of the World Cup. Today's avalanche game against the Predators is postponed. Tonight, the Nuggets face the Clippers at 8.30. And in local sports, brought to you by Cassandra Schultz and Associates with American Family and Dylan. Season opener for the Breckenridge Vipers hockey team is less than a month away, December 16th, when the Vipers face the Vale Yeti at home. Phil Lindemann, Crystal, 93 News.